Serna, the kicker for Oregon State. He missed three extra points against LSU last year, costing the Beavers the biggest upset victory in program history. After that unforgettable game, Alexis learned a lesson from someone he had never met, that life and death have nothing to do with extra points. Fighting not only for his job as a starting kicker, but also for a scholarship, Alexis Cerna's career came into question before it ever had a chance to begin. We actually demoted him for a time, and maybe he doesn't get to kick again in college. I mean, that's, that's where it was. I was looking to, to go to another school because I thought I was done. I didn't think I was going to be able to get back on the field after that. With the ashes of what might have been college football's greatest upset of the year piled at his feet, Alexis had nowhere to turn until a letter appeared in his team mail only days after the game. I sat down on my stool in front of my locker and I saw it was from the hospital. Dear Alexis, Dear Alexis sorry you had an awful day in Louisiana. I've had I've some had bad, bad days myself. myself but the most important thing is to get up again and do what you know you can do. If I can do it, so can you. Give me a call. call if you can. Go Beavers, Austin Pierce. I had a picture of him in there, and I just sat there for like five minutes just in, in shock. It was just unbelievable to get a letter like that. Just to know a kid like that is going through that, and I just felt like guilty for even thinking bad about what I had done. And the story of these two continues in a very good way. Well, you know what? After watching that piece, all of us here that saw it were like, we wish Austin could meet Alexis Cerner because he helped him so much. And, of course, we have good news to report. A follow-up on this story. Austin did get a chance to meet Alexis Cerner. It was last Friday before the Washington State game. The Washington State game on Saturday. And look at this. Hugging. I mean, a priceless moment. Not only for Austin, who, of course, wrote the letter, but how about Alexis Cerner? You think he'd probably want to meet this kid for a long time now? little perspective. Unbelievable. Great stuff.